Hello everyone, welcome back to Tactics. So in today's video, I'm going to review the latest update of Paranoid Android for Nothing Phone 2. And this is still based on Android 14. This is version 2.1, which is a hotfix version actually. Uh, previously 2.0 was released, but it was having some issues related to safety net and it is a 2.1 hotfix update which is coming with the safety net fix and you can see the security update is of 5th april 2024 you can see the kernel version here the kernel is upstream to clo and you can see the change log here on the telegram community page basically this update is directed towards performance and not much visual changes the only visual change you will get in this update is the status bar padding you can see the status bar corners are perfectly matched to nothing phone 2 now yes i just want to tell you one thing that i have uh, you know dirty flash this custom room over the something os which was you know released by dylan apk or sorry dylan dylan akp and i have dirty flash paranoid android over something os and i am getting some issues i'm facing some issues like system seizure uh, system is getting stuck and i have to forcefully forcefully reboot it if you want to get rid of something like this just clean flash this custom room uh, flash it after formatting data only now talking about safety net in this update so if you are not uh, using root if you're not using majisk or if you're not using the kernel su then you will get safety net fixed by default and you will not need to flash any module to fix the safety net i have flashed majisk and i have also flashed safety net fix module so it is passed here and i am completely able to use banking application just this one is not working which is a yono sbi this room comes with this uh, google camera pre-installed which is having snapchat features and i have installed this google camera over this and nothing camera over this as well and google camera is clicking perfectly great snaps talking about the ui and thing everything is uh, same as before the launcher is same uh, the qs panel is same the settings is same but yes you will see some improvements in uh, this glyph interface the glyph interface is much improved and the notifications are accurate now i'm using the essential notification feature and it is working perfectly fine for whatsapp and yes you will uh, see features like volume indicator and music visualizer but yes uh, no features like glyph progress is there so you can count on your zomato order Talking about bugs, so you will not face any major bug in this custom room. Uh, yes, as I said that I have dirty flashed it, so I'm facing some system seizure issues, but you need to flash it clean. The connectivity is good, the Bluetooth is working fine, Wi-Fi is working fine as well. And I have no issues with Volti and I have no issues with 5G. 5G speed is definitely good on this one as well. In display settings, you will see dark theme is there and uh, you can completely enable the pure black. Let me do it from here. You can enable this pure black theme or you can just use the Google dark theme as well. And basically everything is same here. So you will not find anything different here and everything is working fine. You will not face any issue with any feature in this custom room. Now talking about battery life. So battery life is definitely improved as said by the maintainer only. I can feel the battery life is improved and I can use the phone for completely full day. If I'm using it normally without any games and if you are playing games, you will get the battery backup for five to six hour. That will be uh, the max output you will get from this battery life. The best thing about Paranoid Android is the wallpapers. You will get these beautiful wallpapers with Paranoid Android and uh, the theming options are working fine. You can def definitely enable the theme icons from here and you can uh, just change the app grid options. You can select the system icons from here. If you want to change the shapes and icon pack for status bar are also available here system fonts are also available not much options are available but yes uh, there are few options available which you can use and you can uh, definitely change the monitor themes from here the room is very very snappy and very smooth you will not face any lag in this ui uh, it is also working on 120 hertz you can also do gaming on this but i guess the gaming needs to be a little bit improved on this because i can see uh, the fps drops too much on this custom room but for full review of gaming on this paranoid android custom room i'm going to upload it on my uh, playtex gaming channel so please subscribe to it video will be uploaded on this one only the gaming review will be available uh, before this video is launched and also the fingerprint speed is improved on this one as per the maintainer and also yes i can feel that it is a little bit improved and yes i was not facing any issues in previous update as well now guys that was it in this update uh, i hope uh, you like the video if you like the video please subscribe to this channel because more videos are coming to this and yes the latest update of nothing was 2.5.5 is released the next update is going to be on that one so please subscribe to the channel and subscribe to playtex gaming as well and yes go and join the group for nothing telegram community i will put the links in description so thank you guys let's meet in the next video